What's going on YouTube? This Kingston, Jamaica, man. I know it's kind of dark. But yeah, um, I'm finally back in California. Um, the truck they end up giving me is an international. It's a pretty nice truck. It's pretty big and spacious. It's a temporary truck. I mean, it's pretty brand new. But yeah, I'm finally here, man. I'm loving it, man. I'm loving it, but yeah, man. Uh, I will give you guys a tour of the truck, but you know, it's raining out here, pretty windy. I'm not really trying to jump out in the rain, to be honest with you. I'm not trying to do all that, but um, 2016 International. It drives real great. That's it, it got some codes, you know, it's pretty sensitive. It's an automatic. You know, I love the automatic. Despite what everybody say about automatic, I love it. I wouldn't drive nothing else but an automatic. It even sees you in your legs. You can focus on driving. I know some drivers say automatic is crap. I think they're full of shit because they never drove an automatic. Once you drive an automatic, you know, you understand like, yo, this is the business. If they tell you don't like an automatic, I mean, they're fucking lying. I mean, <laughs> I know I don't want to be cussing, but fuck it. They're fucking lying. Automatic is the way to go. Yeah, they say automatic is slower. I, I don't know about that. I've driven a manual and I've driven an automatic. And I don't I can't tell the difference when it, with speed, especially if the truck is governed. If you have a governed truck, if you come into any company like major companies besides night, they're all majority of all the trucks gonna be governed. Now once you own your own truck, then you can decide what you want to do, then you can put that to the test. But I have a driving automatic truck or a manual truck for a company, especially a company like Knight, it's not gonna make a difference in speed because you're, you're at 62. Now people say the get up is faster. It doesn't fucking matter. It, you don't go faster. You, 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 it doesn't matter if one get up is faster and one is slower. It, it still doesn't matter. You're still driving 62 to 63 miles per hour, downhill maybe 66, if you're lucky. But that's how it is. Most company, which all companies are governing their truck, any all major carriers are governing their truck, because it's a safety issue. Some of these truck drivers out like they fucking cowboys, you know, burning up the burning up the damn um, brakes and getting some serious fucking accidents because they can't fucking slow down. That's their problem. You know, you see shit like that all the time. I just seen one of those situations coming down on I-10. It's windy as fuck. And you got these drivers out here. Driving like, you know, it's the end of the world type shit. Fucking drive slow. You know, I got drivers blowing at me. I'm driving too slow. It's fucking windy. The fuck you expect? But these are things you're going to expect coming out here as a new driver. Dumb motherfuckers. Just dumbass. I mean, yeah, I don't like cussing. But man, you see the shit, dumb shit, man. You're going to see a lot of dumb shit. That's one thing I can't guarantee you. Dumb shit. I mean, but that's besides the point. The point is, I got a truck. It's a nice 2016 International. I'm only going to be having it for about a week or two till they fix my truck. I mean, I, hopefully I can keep this truck because it's bigger, you know. It's bigger, it's heavier, which I, which I kind of like because, you know, the Volvo is light. It's, you know, when hit, when hit the nose, it's, it's wobbly. It makes a difference. Yeah, you carry, it, you get the haul heavy. But hey, man, it doesn't matter what I haul, I'm a company driver. If I was an owner operator, or a lease operator, of course I'll go with a Volvo because slider is easy on my fuel. But since I am a company driver, it does not matter what I drive. It doesn't matter, I mean, it doesn't really matter how heavy the truck is. The heavier the truck is better for me because it's for a safety reason due to the fact that when turn over small ass Volvos like those. I love the Volvo. I mean, it's. I can't say it's faster than the International because it, it's governed at 62, so the get up, it does not matter to me. I get to where I need to get to at a, an appropriate rate, so it doesn't matter. You know, and um, yeah, man, I mean, I just had a long fucking day, you know, trying to get this truck, but I finally got one. I'm out here in the Fontana yard, I got a parking, you know, which is amazing because there's really no parking out here. We have a lot of trucks. So that's what you get, you know, the, the company making money. So if there's money, there's going to be a lot of trucks. If you go to a terminal, you don't see a lot of trucks there or whatever. At nighttime, that means the company ain't doing that right or something's wrong. But yeah, it's Kingston, Jamaica. One love once again. I'll tune in with you guys on a couple more off day. 
and get back on a new adventure. One love drive safe drivers.